and Headline News Update. Hi everyone, Basil Chapman here. This is the, the t- t- 11 o'clock Tiger Financial News Network Market Update. Dow's up 100 at 31,535. Most importantly, it ran all the way in the leg B to the upside at 31,885 earlier this morning. Is it trying to find some kind of a base right here so that it can move higher? We'll see soon enough. Now, what's really important about this phase, you see this little gap, not a little, huge gap in the Dow from the gap the lower high on the 10th of June, that's at 32,053. So there's this whole gap between 32,000 and that 32,053 area. Um, no, what am I talking about? 30,000, oh, let's do this real quickly. Anyway, there's this gap to fill. You've got a left side, right side price time match. It takes you until about t- tomorrow to be able to get even close to that level. What we got fairly close today. Looking at the S&P, uh, we were talking about the S&P down up uh, 55 cents at 3,900 right now. Most importantly, what's happened with the S&P is that this is just a single leg A. And you would expect that there'd be some kind, oops, there'd be some kind of uh, a, a digestive phase uh, after this leg A, there'd be a peak A, so that you, maybe the high today of 39.45 won't be touched tomorrow. Maybe it'll be Thursday. We'll see. Looking at the QQQ, that's now QQQ. I was in the wrong place. Darn. There it is. One, two, three. So the QQQ is a trading down to at 290. Um, really wants to hold the two, 288 area over the next day or so. Looking at the IWM, the IWM is leg B. It's up 58 cents at 176.32. You're looking at the gold. Uh, gold was weaker earlier. It's still weak. It's down three. Looking at the dollar, it was actually up a little bit. and actually up quite nicely. Oh, it's even more. Up 54 ticks at 104.52. Uh, we're looking at the TLT. TLT is weak, down 63 cents. So yields are going a little higher. You're looking at crude oil. Actually, crude oil had a pretty nice rally. Uh, it's given back some. It's up 70 cents. But this is, I'd say that I thought the 111 to 112 area should be resistance. It did hit 111.72 today on the continuous contract. I'll be back for the next hour to fill in for Larry Pizzavento's hour 11 to 12. Um, yes, trade what you see, but I will be doing my technical aspect to it uh, just so that we can we can have that hour live and we can be looking at exactly this is such an important phase in the market after such a spectacular rally from Friday a week ago. This is really important to be monitoring. Where are we and what are we doing? We'll discuss that as soon as I return for the 11 o'clock to 12 o'clock hour. Usually Larry's show, Larry's voice is still very scratchy and hurting. Hope you can get back to See you in a moment, I'll see you.